Hey, Ashley. I absolutely loved looking at your room. Oh, it looks so exciting. Those kids are so lucky to have you for a teacher, and I know you are so thrilled. It is looking great. Um, this is mine. It's nowhere near done. Um, I'm going to do a little bit of work on it today, and tomorrow we just got a new curriculum in, um, so we spent the last week and a half working on that, and... Um, this is my seventh grade class. All of the classrooms have quotes above it, which is totally cool. I really liked that one, uh, Mark Twain. Uh, but Doctor Who is awesome. Every lots of middle schoolers love Doctor Who, so that'll be. I'm hoping it'll be a good class. My theme is going to be sort of um, the quotable classroom. So hopefully. None of that stuff is up right now, but hopefully in the next couple of days it'll get up because we are starting school soon. So let me show you a quick little before tour. Uh, I moved a bunch of stuff around on my first day here, and then I found out that I couldn't move a bunch of stuff around. Um, like this is, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with this, uh, but it's a safety thing in case we need to do a lockdown. It goes pushed in front of the door. Oh, there's my flag. Yay, America. Uh, my need and I want board. Um, as you can see, nothing is up. Here are my desks. And you know what? These are pretty tricky to try to put into groups. Uh, we're doing a lot of group reading for ELA in seventh grade. And I am spending way too much time in my head trying to figure out what I'm going to do. I saw another room that had them set up into pods of four. I like it all right. We'll see how that goes. Um, I did get one bulletin board, um, at least the back part of it up. And I got this one up. Um, I'm going to have my students, since this is the quotable classroom, um, for one of our get to know you things, I'm going to have them go through a uh, um book of quotes or they can find them online and they're not going to put their name on it or anything we're just going to put them on index cards and draw and i'm going to put them for each of my classes up in here um for the first part of the bulletin board and uh there's our curriculum down there's our cleaning supplies uh every student every day gets bottled water um Got an itty bitty little tiny library going, but that'll improve with time. Um, haven't figured out quite what I'm going to do with that. <sighs> There's my little home shelf. Uh, it's my, one of my wedding pictures. I don't think you've ever seen that. It's my daughter when she was little. It's my daughter from a couple summers ago. And, uh, me and my husband before we had Ava, and I like to have something to cuddle with just in case. Got you know, girl, I got my Declaration of Independence and my Constitution. Um, got a bunch of stuff down there. Um, got some stuff here. I'm going to be doing some unboxings in a minute. Here are some posters I got to put up. Here's some fab fit fun stuff. Uh, here's my little desk. <sighs> I'm thinking what I'm going to do is put up some um, uh, adhesive whiteboard sheet on there and have that be an area where my students can leave me messages or draw me pictures or something. Um, let's see. My mom-in-law... I didn't have a key to this, but my mom-in-law actually contacted the maker of this company. And, uh, because you can contact them and they'll make you a key for it. So, got to organize that a little bit better. Uh, that's where my little mini fridge is going to go when it comes in. I love my view. Look how peaceful that is. The other side has a water view of a little pond, and that's just beautiful. But this reminds me of Little House on the Prairie. And I don't know if you all remember this or not, but I love Little House on the Prairie. So I think this is really just a beautiful environment. Got a nice blue wall. Um, this is going to have lights on it. It's going to have greenery on it. And 
This is the author. You are the author of your own story. I need to fix the letters. And then I'm also have them fill out these little puzzle pieces and put it all around there as an affirmation. So we'll see how that goes. And got some dictionaries and thesauri up there. So this is my room. It's a hot mess right now of nothingness. Um, I'll let you know how it goes. This is so exciting. Um, I will talk to you later and uh, keep me posted on what you're doing. I saw Cheyenne at the parent teacher store and we were talking about how great it would be to get everybody together, maybe meet up somewhere. Um, so I know everybody's crazy right now, but keep that in mind because I don't want to lose touch with you guys. You guys are awesome and uh, you are especially cool. And I hope, uh, I hope that we can hang out soon. I'm going to go. I got lots to do. Lots to do. I still have stuff to clean out. No telling what is in here. Um, but I'll talk to you later. Take care. Bye. Good luck. You're going to be great. You're going to be great.